This is a 2001 Royal Enfield Bullet 500. It is fitted with an Amol 930, that's the model number, 930 concentric carburetor and a uni filter. The carburetor has uh, 200 main jet in it. And that right there is the tickler valve. I've found that if you just push it down one time before you start it, it starts up real good. So I'm going to demonstrate the kickstart procedure now. All right, here we go, the basics. Turn the fuel on. Turn the choke all the way on. Turn the ignition on. And on the carburetor, just push the tickler valve once like this. That raises or that lowers the float and squirts a little bit of extra gas in there to get it started. All right, at this point, I will hold in the compression release lever, which is right here on the handlebar. And then kick it over, with the ignition turned off actually, kick it over about 10 times just to get it, build up some compression and get it ready to start. And then you let go of the compression release and move it around until it stops and you see the amp meter move to the left and then push on the compression release lever until the amp meter goes back to the middle. Alright, here's what that looks like when you're sitting on the bike. There's your amp meter, there's your compression release. To release the compression you push it and to have compression you let go of it. So, kick the kicker around with the ignition with the ignition turned on, kick the kicker around until it stops. Now you'll see that the amp meter is deflected to the left. So at that point, you push on the compression release and just give the, the kicker just a little teeny push until the amp meter goes to the middle. Release the compression release lever, lift the kicker back up and kick it hard and it should start. All right, here we go. As you can see, the engine is ice cold. if she'll go.